Okay, I just want to show you how to uh, hook up a regular switch, a smart switch, uh, to the wires inside of the box. And you'll notice that we've got two black wires and we've got one white wire. The black wire, this one here, always goes to line or load, okay? This white wire goes to the white wires inside the box. You unscrew that cap, plug them in. And then this other black wire right here goes into the red, the other side of the switch. So everything works fine. And there you go. Okay, um, just wanted to show everybody what we're using. I like the uh, Casas Smart Switches the best. They're easy to set up. And uh, this happens to be a, a Casas Smart dimmer switch. So if you have lights like in the living room, dining room or whatever, that you're able to dim the lights, you can literally use Alexa or Google to do that with voice command. You also notice that you can even manually increase or decrease the lighting, but you can also do that in your app when you, when you talk to it and give it instructions. Anyway, that's the uh, smart uh, dimmer switch from Casa. Talk to you soon, bye for now. Okay, now I'm gonna show you the uh, Casa Smart Switch. This is just a regular on and off switch uh, for lighting. Okay, there is no dimmer switch on it, but this is the uh, single pole Casa Smart Switch. And again, they're easy to set up. So there you have it, we'll be back. Okay, so here we have what's called a Casa Smart Wi-Fi Plug Mini. These work really well. These you can put all over the house for your lights, uh, your fans, whatever you want, outside lights, anything that you want that has a, a plug that you wanna be able to turn on and off. And uh, that's the uh, simple smart plug. And there you have it, we'll be back. Okay, one of the most important things that you'll wanna do is make sure that you put all the switches that you took out of the house, because if you move, you wanna be able to take your switches with you and you wanna mark them and name them. As you'll see, we did the front door, we did the front yard, we did the kitchen, the living room, Bob's closet, the bookcase, and the dining room. Everything else that's smart is all done with plugs, smart plugs, and there you have it. We'll be back. Echo, turn on the kitchen. Echo. Turn off the kitchen. Echo, turn on garbage disposal. Echo, turn off garbage disposal. Echo, turn on the bookcase. Echo, turn off the bookcase. Echo, turn on the dining room. Echo, turn off the dining room. Echo, turn on the china cabinet. Echo, turn off the china cabinet. Echo, turn on entertainment. Echo, turn off entertainment. Echo, turn on the front door. Echo, turn off the front door. Echo, turn on the living room. Echo, increase living room by 100%. See how much brighter that got? You can actually tell these dimmer switches what to do. Echo, reduce living room by 50%. Echo, turn off living room. Echo, turn on the office. Echo, turn off the office. Echo, turn on light. Echo, turn off the light. Echo, turn on the guest fan. Echo, turn off the guest fan. Echo, turn on the lamp. Echo, turn off the lamp. Now you'll notice, well, I don't know if you'll notice because you won't, but I have this lamp scheduled from to turn on at 6 p.m. Goes off at 11 p.m. automatically. 
Matter of fact, most of the lights, including the front door, the outside garage, uh, all on timers. Bedrooms are all on timers. Echo, turn on the butterfly. Echo, turn off the butterfly. And again, this one is on schedule. It goes uh, on at 6 p.m. And uh, this one here goes off at about 12.30 p.m. But you can schedule, these are all smart plugs. You can schedule them to go on and off anytime you choose. Echo, turn on the dining room. Echo, increase dining room by 100%. You can see that we can also adjust the, uh, the brightness on these lights. Echo, reduce dining room by 25%. Echo, turn dining room off. And there you have it. So I just wanted to show you that with these light switches, you can turn them on manually too. Say for example, you lose uh, your internet, you can turn it on or off, on or off. And also this, um, let's turn that back on again. You see the little lights down there? That shows you how bright they are. And these two little buttons, you can actually uh, reduce the, uh, the brightness on those lights by pushing those buttons. Now you'll see that this light is dim. And there you go. Okay, so I also put a switch in the closet because believe it or not, the switch is all the way over here in the bathroom. Just to go in the closet, we had to come all the way around the corner. So basically, now we gotta do is say, Echo, turn on the closet. There you go, Echo, turn off the closet. And there you have it. Okay, now let me show you what we did in the garage. I got a motion detector because there's no windows in the garage door. So basically you open the garage door up, completely dark, you come out and there goes the light. Got a little motion detector up here, turns the light on and then it's got a uh, two minute timer Stays on for two minutes and goes off. Echo, turn on the fan. Echo, turn off the fan. And there you have it, outside. Okay, the last thing that we're gonna take a look at is the outside. Echo, turn on the backyard. Echo, reduce the backyard by 50%. Echo, turn on the outside lights. Echo, reduce the outside lights by 50%. Echo, reduce the outside lights by 25%. Echo, reduce the backyard by 25%. And there you have it, guys. I uh, hope you like this video. If you do, Please like the video and share it with anybody you like. I appreciate your time. Thank you and have a great day. Bye for now.